गुड आफ्टरनून स्टूडेंट माई सेल्फ मिसेस स्नेहा स्ने पारिंगे असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी फ्रॉम सांगू काना ठाकुर आर्ट्स कॉमर्स साइंस कॉलेज न्यू पनवेल ऑटोनॉमस सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द टॉपिक स्विच स्टेटमेंट इन C++. प्लस प्लस प्रीवियसली वी हैव ऑलरेडी सीन वट इज फॉर लूप इफ एल स्टेटमेंट if statement there are all statement statements we have already studied now we are going to see what is switch statement switch statements are basically conditional structures conditional statements where all the uh, whenever you want to uh, run several cases or repetitive actions that time you have run this switch uh, statement so um in a if else statement i either you can print one or two statements so whenever you want to run more than one or more uh, statements that time you can use this switch statement so, so in a switch statement there are two keywords that is break and default will be used so what is break in the break keyword the break keyword is used in switch case at the end of every case block so that the when the matching case is executed the program control comes out of the loop so basically when whatever the number is entered in the switch case that will be matched with any case in the program then the break will break keyword will execute that particular statement and end the program next we can see the default keyword so this default keyword is used to define a default case which will be executed when no case value is matched so all the cases when check by the compiler to match with the switch case if it is not found then whatever the default case uh, with the invalid input is there that will be get printed so this is what the break keyword and defa default keyword which we will use in switch case now we will see the next what is syntax of switch so in a switch you have to write the expression of the switch which needs to be checked with the all the cases and in that you have to write all the cases which which is there so in a case one you have to again write the statement which needs to be get printed and if it is matched with the switch expression that that particular case should be break by the break keyword at all after writing all the cases you will at the end you will write the default statement where why we will write this default statement that if all the cases are checked and no result found match with the switch expression then the default statement will be get printed now we will see the flow chart of this switch case uh, switch case that in a switch expression when this expression is written all the cases will be match with that expression if the case one is match then the statement with one will be get printed and pre program will be get terminated likewise every case will be checked and if all the case uh, cases are not match with the switch expression then default statement will be get printed next we will see the example of switch case statement so here we, i have taken the program to di display the weekdays so in uh, in a first we have to enter by, from the user the weekday number suppose the weekday number should be 1 then the sunday will be get printed so case 1 we have written as sunday and if the it is matched then it will break likewise monday tuesday up to the saturday and if all the after writing all the cases we will write the default statement that is invalid input it means if the user entered the number 8 then it will not match any of the cases written and that's why it will print the default statement that is invalid input so suppose we can consider the user has entered the number 7 or number 3 then here is the output that after entering the week number 3 it will get printed tuesday and if it is printed 5 then it will print thursday so likewise the you will get an output thank you